So this piece is called The Annunciation of Mary. Um, it can be found in Vienna, Austria at the Belvedere Palace. It's uh, made by Paul Troger, who's an Austrian painter, um, and it is oil on canvas. Um, this is a romantic piece, but it looks more Baroque, in my opinion. Um, so the sketch for the middle part of the ceiling fresco, this was made for um, the middle part of the ceiling fresco in a Jesuit church. It's just a sketch. It wasn't actually supposed to go up. Um, it's unknown how long it took to create. Um, and a little bit more about Paul Troger. So he's an Austrian painter and draughtsman and a printmaker. Um, and his illusionistic ceiling paintings in fresco are notable for their dramatic vitality of movement and their palettes of light color. Um, his style of frescoes quickly dominated the style of all Austrian painting uh, during this period. Um, I think this piece is a really, really gorgeous piece. Um, it's really bold and beautiful and immediately caught my attention. Um, his use of light colors and tones to make this piece a signature of his. Um, and the angels fly around as Mary sits on the steps during her Annunciation. Uh, in the foreground, we see a lot of clouds right here and up here. Um, it almost seems like the clouds open up so we can see the beautiful thing, which I thought, so we could see this beautiful scene, um, which I thought was a really, really nice, and that was a nice touch. Um, I'm going to assume that this piece is Baroque. I'm going to compare it to a Baroque piece because that's what it looks like more to me. Um, so Baroque painting is characterized by great drama, rich and deep color, um, intense light and dark shadows. And I think this piece fits that very, very well. Um, but yeah.